What's cracking Jump Nation family? It's your boy Hiroshi Yes, aka The Jump Rope Coach. People's uh, loads of questions coming in, all right? We have got the Money Rope Performance Pack restocking tomorrow. Hear the details, all right? 4 p.m. UK time. One of the main questions I've been getting a lot recently, right, is what are the differences between the new upgraded Money Rope Performance and the iconic old school version one Money Rope, okay? Now, today I wanted to make a video. I want to get it out there on the channel and make sure the whole of the internet, you guys at home, are fully aware, fully clear on what are the differences, uh, what you're gonna get in this box, what are the comparisons, what is best for you, all that kind of stuff, all right? So remember, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button. We're the hottest fitness community growing across the world today. This is the number one channel to learn how to skip like a boss. And listen, guys, this is gonna be a very short video, but a few things to remember, okay? I wanna hit a few points here. Like, there are different prices, there are different feels, and they're not necessarily made for different types of skippers, but just keep in mind that, you know, I'm trying to improve the skipping game. I'm trying to take the levels higher and higher. I'm trying to make improvements here and there. So although some of the improvements might seem a little bit small to you or very incremental, remember we started four years ago with what is considered now a very simplistic piece of plastic. And now we're trying to step the game up and move it forward, all right? So let's get straight into this. I'm gonna unbox the new Money Rope 2.0 aka Money Rope Performance. You can see what you get in this performance pack and then we're gonna do the comparison uh, as we go along, right? So the performance pack, guys, is online. It's ready to go pre-order tomorrow, like I said, but you get a ton of stuff, all right? The reason why I made this pack was because I wanted any entry-level skipper, any advanced skipper, just basically be equipped with everything they need to get skipping and making sure that they take care of their ropes and everything else, right? So we'll get into all that as well. So as you unbox this now, right? Bearing in mind as well, on the box, we've upgraded a few things, okay? We've got like a little scannable QR. Um, it's again, a little bit more environmentally friendly. We're trying to do our bit for the environment as well, okay? So what you get, right, is you get an extra 11 foot speed cable, right? Which is, this is handy, okay? So this is for those of you who wanna, again, maybe have a longer rope, or you may have an issue with your existing rope that comes on the rope. You kind of get my drift. Um, and it just keeps you going, right? If there's any problems or anything like that, any breakages and that kind of thing. We'll keep that to one side. Then you get a carry case for the actual rope. Now, very, very cool carry case. Um, the cottons, the materials we've used for this, environmentally friendly, very kind of like cool graded uh, cotton. Nothing really fancy, but just keeps your ropes nice and neat when you're on the go. Store it up, take it. You don't want your ropes kind of being tangled in your bag, gym bag, or not being stored correctly. So that's that, good bonus. And then we get these grip tapes, okay? Now the grip tapes will come to kind of in a little bit more detail, but really and truly, it's just very simplistic, right? Like if you wanna have more grips on your handles when you're skipping, if you sweat a lot, if you wanna try releases um, and your handles gonna be smashed on the floor, like these will offer a lot more protection. Custom branded Money Rope Russia Flex grips, okay? Now I've got videos on this on how to apply it, so go back, check those, we're not gonna cover that today. But ton of things, all right, come in this performance pack. And like I said, I wanna make the most coolest skipping experience out there for everyone and that's why we created this pack. So getting straight into this rope right guys, um, I'm gonna kind of keep it very like easy going okay, we're just gonna do a quick comparison. So straight off the bat okay, this is the new handle okay, and it's just there's so much to talk about but let's just go with kind of the look, the feel, the size first okay, so just basically just the overall kind of first impressions compared to the old money rope. Now, when we compare, right, just like for like straight away, in terms of kind of like handle length, I really, really liked the original handle length of the money rope one. Okay, so we went with the same handle length here for this new upgrade. Now, you might think, right, is that a good thing or a bad thing? First off, right, like when it sits in the hands, I've got pretty kind of cool, I'd say not massive hands. Yeah, I'm not in this one. <laughs> Why not, bro? Why are you not in it? You said you got cool hands. Man says he's got cool hands. All right, edit and Nathan, back to the video. But these were always the perfect fit for me. And I know if you've got bigger, bigger hands there, you might say you want a longer speed rope or a handle. 
but we've got an icon rope for that, okay? If you want longer handles, we've got that covered for you. In terms of kind of like the shape, you're gonna see that there are similarities. Again, we've gone with the wing for the Money Rope 2, very similar, obviously, to the old style. There are a few changes that we're gonna talk about in a minute, but ultimately, that wing is made for you to sit and kind of like have the handle sit on the pad, on the heel pad of this hand. So as you're rotating it, you really wanna feel like that is a control that kind of supports the rope, and then obviously your thumb will come down the handle. So that's why we went with the length, the feel, the ergonomic kind of design with the wing, um, like we did before. So they're kind of similar, right? So you're thinking, all right, what's different? So then we kind of go into kind of like materials now. The materials are really what sets this thing apart because this polymer used here was um, just a kind of generic plastic polymer, okay? Now this is something that if thrown around or chucked on the floor or for whatever reason, right, slips out your hand really like vigorously, this could smash. Now people say to me, well, what's the point of that? But you know, skipping's meant to be, the rope's supposed to be in your hands, guys, all right? Like I've always said it, man, and I've always been an advocate for keeping your ropes in your hands. They shouldn't be used for smashing on the floor and these were never meant to be for freestyle skipping. So that said, I wanted to make a rope that would accommodate freestyle skipping, which is why we have the grips as well, just to offer a bit more protection. But the handles, um, the materials, the composition of the materials, the polymer, we've now gone with a nylon resin finish, okay? So you're gonna see like in the close-ups, like it's a lot more kind of matte finish, very durable. I've also done a vlog on this in the past where I put the handles underneath the car. We ride the, we, we drive the car over the handle, like they're very, very strong. Um, and is there as strong as they can be without obviously like messing up the kind of feel and the weight. When it comes to weight, okay, so you don't want to compromise the weight and the durability. You don't want something that's super durable, but then really heavy on the hand. So obviously these are going to come in a little bit heavier. So they come in about five to 10 grams heavier than the original Money Rope 1. And you're going to feel that, especially if you own both ropes. You're going to feel like this has a little bit more weight to it, a little bit more feel, but it doesn't disturb the balance, which is really important. Then the last bit that I want to talk about is the small changes in terms of the ergonomics, right? They're really kind of fine details, very incremental, but like I said, we're trying to find new levels, we're trying to improve. So on the old design, this kind of finish here at the, at the tip of the, the handle was very sharp. When I say it's sharp, I mean, I've got like, oh yeah, basically got like scratches and I've got like scars to, to show when I've been doing crossovers and I'll scratch myself, but they were very sharp. That said as well, that the handle mouth was cut, not sharp, but it was cut in a certain way that I really wanted to make sure that I can try and get a bit more smoother revolutions from the new design. So what we did was we curved off the sort of end of the handle tip here. So it just has a really nice kind of finish. We also offered a slightly more larger handle mouth or rope mouth even. So when the rope now spins, it has a different kind of feel, especially if you're kind of advanced. If you're advanced, you're gonna feel that kind of difference. This now spins slightly different. It spins a slightly more smoother and having the larger kind of handle mouth with the indent, indentation in that kind of mouth, it offers as well a little bit more support for the rope, especially like if you're someone who's a beginner and like really spins a rope in a different way, it kind of sometimes can snag and you can, it can basically lead to breakages. So we don't want that. So that's why we went with that. And we've also created a new kind of indentation, a new little strip here on the wing for aesthetic purposes. So that said guys, it's quite similar, but there's these small increments and the, the main one that I really wanted to get done with this new handle was obviously have the RA logos embossed in permanent. Um, one of the features of the old handle, which was obviously I already knew and people were giving me feedback was they would like these logos to remain. So obviously this was a laser print or like a screen print. And then with this handle, this is a completely different mold. Customization is on like next levels, like I said. And we've got the Money Rope logo, the new trademarked Money Rope logo, wing logo as well as the, the Rush Athletics embossed in. So that's permanent. It looks super slick, very, very unique. Last bits now, just kind of wrapping things up is I know a lot of people then asking me like, are these gonna be available on Amazon? Are you gonna create a beaded version? And yes, we are, right? We've got new things in the pipeline. We have a new standalone Money Rope packaging box. This is a Money Rope 2 box, okay? So this is just gonna be the rope by itself. This obviously is the pack, comes with all the extras I've just mentioned today. With this one, this is gonna be available soon, hopefully on Amazon, coming in the next kind of like eight weeks, six to eight weeks. It's just gonna come with the rope itself. Then we also have a beaded version, which will obviously be new handles, but with a beaded rope. This rope will still remain, guys. This is not gonna be discontinued. This for me is the heart of the RA community. Um, this is again like the, the, 
the real kind of foundation. This is a real foundation. This is a real foundation for, for this movement for me, okay? This was the first product that we introduced. It brought a community together. It made people believe, it made people love cardio. It made people just have a new vision and an outlook on life. And, and for me, like this is gonna remain, this is the, the staple product for the, for the RA family. And um, yeah, the one that was used by Mayweather after all those years after I saw his video. So like it has a lot of meaning for me. So we're still gonna remain with this one. It's gonna be our, our rope that keeps everything accessible. Our entry point for this one is different to this, of course. Peoples, I hope that kind of made a little bit more sense. I hope you guys kind of get a bit more of an understanding between the differences of these two ropes. They're both gonna be iconic in their own right. Both of them are, are just the best, like for if you're a beginner, up to advanced, okay? That's what I always do. Whenever I bring out a rope, it's not just made for someone who's just got extra skill than someone who's just got nothing or no experience, all right? This is made for people who pick up a rope for the first time as well as someone who's trying to improve their game and basically try and get better and better at skipping. So just keep that in mind, okay? So otherwise, guys, we're gonna keep developing as much as we can. This is gonna be around for a long time. I already know this is gonna change cardio as always. Um, we're hoping to introduce it to shops and get it like, yeah, across the world even more as much as possible. But after two sellout launches already, the restock is back tomorrow. Um, they keep going fast, guys, so you need to be in quick, set those alarms. I'm bringing in a massive shipment, okay? So I'm trying to cater to all this demand coming in. I'm trying to supply it all. But yeah, it's gonna be available in more countries, put it that way. So folks, I appreciate you watching this video. If you did watch it, you obviously have an understanding of skipping ropes, if you're interested in, in rush ropes, hit those links, sign up to our newsletters, download our app. There's loads of things happening in the Rush Athletics world and I'd love you guys to keep getting involved and sharing your journey with us. So without further ado, I'll check you in that next video. So take care of yourself, skip the treadmill, stay safe. Peace. Was the knight in shining armor in your movie? Put your lips on mine and love the aftertaste now.